Okay, here we go. Wow. Let's get out of there. And let's delete all of our stuffs. Now that's our inventory. Okay. Right, I think this will probably do. Double check that everything is okay. Right, and that seems okay. Just check that we are broadcasting, guys. Hopefully we are. Yes, we are. Good, good, good. Just quickly check. Refresh our page. Here we go. So if we click on this. Yeah. Okay. All right, so we are back, and just a simple house tutorial for you guys today. Oh, I need to get this video. That's better. All right, so it is just a very, very simple house tutorial. We will probably start. I'm just going to quickly put something on. Twitter and Facebook saying that I am live streaming. Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Good. So, hey guys. I am doing a live stream. Please tune in. I'd appreciate it. Thanks. Here, I'll. Here's a link. Alright, so if we go and we do that, and we copy that link into here. Okay, let's, let's post that. Alright, and now let's go into... Actually, no, I'm going to, to copy and paste that entire message. If I copy that, okay, there we go. So that's pretty simple. So that's actually already on there. So that's good. Okay, let's get ourselves into full screen and let's start. Oh, we'll start in a second anyway. See, I don't know if we have anyone tuning in at the moment. I don't know if we do actually, I don't think we do. So let's go live. I don't think we do. I'm pause that quickly. I don't really care. If we have you know one or two, then that's fine. 
That's all I really need for a first live stream. So yes, let's get started. So the main blocks that you will probably need to use, or that you will need to use, is you will need oak wood. That's you can use it with any other one, but I prefer oak wood. And I got like the lighter planks for this, so I think that's quite nice. And we also need some couple. You can make it out of anything else as well. You can make it out of cyan wool, lime wool, red wool, sandstone, lapis, anything you really want. But for this example, I'm just going to use oak wood, birch wood, planks, and cobble. I will take that, that's fine. Need some glowstone. That's quite smart, actually, I quite like that. Um, we will need some. Let's see. We will need some ladders. And I'll just take that for the moment. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to make a 8 by 8. Pretty sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's what we need to do. But I'm just going to actually start with the floor. Like, literally the actual middle of the floor. Because that's, that's what I always do whenever I'm making this house. And I make this house a lot. Trust me, a lot. So... This is the main house that I will always build. Well, almost always, unless it's like a jungle. Right, there we go. And basically, what you need to do is actually start off with oak wood there. And then what you want is wooden planks. So, this bit is actually going to be the middle. This bit where you put cobble, and this bit where you put wood. Now, this is actually going to be covered up with wood like that, but we'll do that later on. But keep out your wood, and then just go around that with wood. Sorry if I'm going a bit too fast and not talking very much, but I just want to quickly get this done. Since it is on our first one anyway, we'll always be looking for feedback. So yes, that is basically the main floor we're actually going to have. So next, what we actually need to do is we need to make the base, I'm pretty sure, yeah, the base. Now, for that, now this is actually going to be the, oh, my mouse lagged out. Um, you will need to cover every side except leave these corners with wood. Basically, any bit that you actually have logs at, you'll cover that up with wooden planks. Now I do have connected textures on, that's why that looks like that. Plus this is in fact pure BD craft. I'll try and see if I can get a link to work somehow. But anyway, what you want to do is you want to put another layer except from where you want your front to be. Front you need to leave a two gap. And then just go around that. Like this. There we go. Alright, so there we go. You can see that. Then you want your oak wood up one again on each of the corners. There we go. So that it's pretty much level. And then what you want to do is one, two, three. I'll go up another three. On each side. There we go. So that basically your house will now look like this. So now, since this is going to be my entrance, I'm going to quickly put some stone, stone blocks, stone stairs here and here. We're going to have some glowstone either side. It can also be um, like a torch or something if you don't have glowstone, but if you're making this in creative, then it's always good to have glowstone. There we go. So, 
and then turn it that way. So that is our, basically our main entrance. So if I um, do this and set time day, if it, if I can turn my chat, oh, if I turn my chat back off, or my back on, I should say, and do time set. Why is the time not set back to one six thousand? All right, time set one. So that works. Time set fourteen hundred. I don't understand. Let's see if that work. Oh, slash time set sixteen hundred. There we go. That's what I meant to do. So you can see that this bit is actually lit up. Which is completely fine. Now, also, what you're going to need is you either, if you want glass panes, use glass panes. If you want glass, normal glass, then you just use normal glass. But before you do that, just make sure you have that in the hotbar. You want to go up like this and sort of make like a little window. That's it. Just like that. You want to do that the same for all three sides. So, simple as this, but for this one you just want to have it like that, so basically it's just going up three, and then you just want to leave it at that. Now we will put in the windows, but I always do that last, you can do that right now if you want, but I'm not going to stop, I'm not going to stop the uh, live stream just to do that, just for you guys to do that. So anyway, what you want to do next is you want to build that wooden planks up three then bring it across so you still have a two gap enough for a door and then yeah that is basically your bottom floor so I'm gonna leave the glass but anyway what you want to do is you want to get your oak wood back in your hand again and you want to do that so cover up where you had that cobble now I was actually thinking about using that Instead of that, have um, something nicer like uh, maybe have some sandstone or something. Cause sandstone looks quite nice with this texture pack or smooth sandstone instead of um, birch and cedar cobble. But usually, if you have just a normal texture pack, it'll look better. Then just build up with your ladders. Oh, just normally. And you want your cobble. Like that, and last but not least, some more wooden planks. So I'm, I don't know, I don't know why this is this is, but you can only actually place oak wood planks, so you can't place them like that unless it's actually got something underneath it. So just place down your birch wood in like a triangle like that, or like a three like that, and then just quickly put down your oak wood so that it works. Basically, it looks like that. You're going to do that same for all corners. So I always fill. Oh, there we go. Three. Oh, two, three. Dang it. Okay, um, and then you just want to fill that back up with your ladders, actually, I meant to say that. And then, in every gap, like that, basically, you're going to put wooden planks. So, pretty much, just the two and then the bit in between. So that your roof, well, the roof on, on the for the first floor should look like that. And then, all you want to do is just cobble. Or whatever other um, material material you're using. So that basically that is your that is your upper, oh well, your bottom floor done. 
Now, I'm not going to add in the glass panes the now either. So yeah, this is what you should have so far for your simple for your simple house. I might change that to sandstone later. You know, but you know that's just my preference. I prefer sandstone and well, smooth stone in this texture pack. Smooth sandstone, sorry, smooth sandstone. I always get that mixed up. Um, rather than cobblestone, but that's just my preference. So also, what you want to do is move that so you have wooden planks like that pretty much now this is going to be basically the setup for your roof ooh big mouse lag then you just want to build that up with wood and put your wooden planks like that so that that's basically what it looks like and then put your wood on top. It was a lot easier when this is a lot easier on Xbox because you don't have the update yet that makes your wooden planks like that. So basically this is what your house should look like. Or this is what the roof should look like at the moment. Now you can see it's sort of starting to take shape as a house. Or as you can, you know, just fly through here freely. Now I know this is a super flat world and I don't understand uh, why that happens, but actually, one second. There we go. I like it when it's bright. I mean, sand also looks quite nice in this, but you can't exactly put sand like that. You know, because then that'll just fall down, so sandstone works a lot better. And now, what we're going to do is we're probably going to do the roof. Yeah, we're going to do the roof. And for the roof, you just want to not do that. Put your stone stairs. And you just want to do this that on this first. So it does actually go on the bottom as well. You want to do that on each side. Now this is actually the easiest way. Well, I don't actually know if it's the easiest way or if it's the quickest way to do a roof. You probably just like go over it with wood, but this gives you more space and it looks better, frankly. So then you want to build that along. Sorry, in a live stream, this lags out. Pretty simple. And pretty simple. And you just might do the exact same on the side. And I'll try and be as quick as I can with this. But it is a bit hard. Because in a live stream you can't exactly just speed things up. Or at least I don't know how to. What? Right, that's a strange thing. I placed that right there. There we go. There we go. So if you can hear things in the background, that's just something. There we go. Alright. And then... Very simple indeed. I 
If you just want to bring this out one, because it, make, it makes it look more realistic. Or more medieval as well, if you're actually going to make like a medieval city. This is um, a house that I always use for like some medieval cities and things. I mean, usually I definitely make this on um, Xbox. It's a simple house to make. Just can sometimes be a pain to actually get the supplies for it, especially the wood, unless you're in like a jungle. But jungle wood isn't always the best looking thing for this. Alright, sorry about that. It's just there. Uh, my dad and that watching a question of sport, which I was actually going to watch, but I decided no. Phil Tuffin was funny on a question of sport, like some of the challenges they get them to do. Psh, wacky. See, that's what I don't understand. It's like glass works with connected textures, but glass panes doesn't. You dirt. Let's do that. Just got a bubble in the back of my throat there. So you just yeah, you just want to fill the top bit of that with uh, the glass panes or glass whatever you have, and then yeah, that's pretty much you nearly done. So you want to swap that for? I shouldn't. I should have just chose. Now I'm going to make actually the inside oak wood then. I want to see what it looks like. I've never done this before. It looks a bit dull, but I guess you always want a house to look a bit quirky and things. If people criticize and just, you know, change it, it's not going to make much of a difference. I mean, you can't get birch wood stairs, I don't think, can you? So this is basically us just doing the interior, so you won't need them anymore. And what you, what you will need is you will need a chest, you'll need a crafting table, you need a furnace, you, or if you want you can have an ender chest and things. You can have anvil, things like that. Um, I'm going to grab some bookshelves as well. So you see this here? This empty space you want to fill with a chest, double chest. And then here you want to move it to your crafting table, and then to your furnace. And then this bit with chest as well. And you can always actually fill these bits in with anvils or an ender chest, or here you can have anvils instead, but I'm just going to keep it like that for the time being. So you can get rid of them now. But what you will need now is you will need a bookshelf. I don't even know how I have five levels, but I do. Um, and you just want to place this along here so it looks a bit more like a bedroom. Because that is what this, this room is going to be. There we go. And if we get rid of that, now you will want your beds. You can always have like an item frame or something somewhere. Painting maybe up there on the walls. We have some saplings and things that we could have. Could do some cobwebs if you want it to look like spooky and things. Bedrock you can use to put into like a spooky house and things. It'll all work. <gasps> you can get birchwood stairs, yay! That's awesome. Alright, and then I can just get rid of that and I can get my birchwood planks back. I keep forgetting that you can actually do that. And then I'm not sure whether I should place down some asylum because that'd be quite cool. You can also have like a, a wall around it, but I'm not going to do that. I wish I'd bring out like um, oh, wood wood versions of these because that'd be quite cool. But what you'll also need is you'll actually need to bring out your stone stairs and cobblestone slab as well. Now you want your cobblestone slab there. Not there. It's downstairs. So it looks like too many beds. You can also have your beds there if you want, but I like to. If it's a single house, there you go. 
and then you can also if you really desperately need some more storage you know just put in a just put in a thing there and then that should be you so so oh yeah I actually forgot to put in a door didn't I derp uh, where's the doors? Redstone. I know. I know. And I'm gonna quickly change these to my pref. Oh, I'm really bad with my mouse today. Like, derp, de derp. Okay. And I'm gonna put birchwood plank. Birchwood plank. Birchwood plank. Mm, birchwood plank, quickly birchwood stairs, and then we will put in our doors to finish off. So yeah, now if we put in our doors, this is the final touch, and there we go. So yeah, that is it, guys. Pretty much. A simple house, very simple basic house that you can make it the start of any Minecraft game if you have the supplies. Obviously I don't because it's a super flat world but still. You know, you can decorate the outside and everything so yeah, I'm going to quickly end this live stream. I know this might look a bit weird on your thing but I will.